Hello and welcome back to the channel and we are back in War Thunder, I guess. So yeah, here in this video we're gonna talk about how to enable the replay rewind feature or the snapshot feature in the replay system. So as you can see on the timeline scrubber there's green lines on the top. So that's the snapshot feature that War Thunder added in the replay, replay system. So we have to go back to the main menu to enable that. So once in the main menu, we're going to go to options and then we're going to go down to replays and spectator mode. And over here, remember to auto enable auto save your replays and enable record a rewindable replay. Snapshots recording interval in a replay in seconds. So what I have this set is to 60 seconds. So there's other options here. 10, 30, and 120, but I have mine on 60, so it doesn't clutter my timeline that much. As you can see in the green lines, that's 60, those are snapshots per 60 seconds. So here's a quick demonstration on one of my replays. Now we're in the game, I'm gonna click one of these green lines. I think it's green, I'm, I'm a bit color blinded. And here we go, it jumps us straight to the scene that we want to shoot. Now we're just gonna adjust the camera angle, enable the depth of field in game. And click it again. And then there you go. You have your shot now. It makes it a lot easier. So I hope you find this video helpful. If you did, please hit that like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any more questions, leave them in the comment section down below. What the hell is this? <laughs> I guess this is one of the replay bug issues that a lot of people have been t telling me. So yeah, there's an issue in the replay. So yeah, once again, if you have any more questions, please leave in the comment section down below. Special thanks to my Patreon supporters for this month. Sniper, Eggboy, and Atlas. Thank you guys for watching and the game crashed. What the hell? See you on the next one. Sparky is out.